stuff up. There we go. Now you hear that. It's good. And the deep size. We'll make him do that more and more often throughout. The I will punch you through this microphone. Make sure I'm out cold then. Okay. I will get cl closer. Okay. Come on. I'm ready. <laughs> I get a nap in. I don't know what sleep is. All right. Uh, sleep. Yeah, I was gonna say sleep. Even what I is, don't know what that is. Oh no. What is the sleep you speak of, people? Um, I need the it's screen. for the week. Ah, uh, crap! Oh, uh, yeah, exactly. You can sleep when you're dead. Uh, exactly. I barely <laughs> sleep when I'm alive. <laughs> What's that? What are you talking about? Damn, no idea. What? Are you, you know the, the you know the uh, <clears throat> the American worker grind set. Uh, grind. Imagine working. <laughs> oh, I mean, job. Uh, right. I mean, could, couldn't more be free me. time. <laughs> couldn't more free time for six months. <laughs> Hey, man. Uh, it's been rough everywhere now. Couldn't be Mercer since he turned 18. <laughs> I mean, again, more free time to me. <laughs> yeah, but less to do. With oh, God, that's loud. Sorry. Oh. That's where YouTube comes in. Uh, Did you say YouTube? Yes. Because, like, I get to watch. The word of God, you said YouTube. YouTube. <laughs> That's a the YouTube. band? <laughs> I mean... I said YouTube. YouTube. I mean, the music's okay, I guess. <laughs> Hang on, let me switch. Uh, so how's everyone doing? <laughs> Decently well. Are we alive? Dying inside. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Dead. Come on, stupid commercial. Goodbye. Me, me, me. Okay, I'll just let it play. I'm not seeing ads at the moment. <laughs> it's not an ad. It should. Oh, God, I hope there's no, no ad. <laughs> Kidding me? Oh crap! I need to check that. There yeah, shouldn't be. Say, a... I'm I'm on the stream right now and it's like. Just, no music. I put some oh. stuff on the way from Netflix. I just let it kind of play quietly. Well, as quiet as it let me. I don't know why it's. <laughs> Hello, Galaxy, Hello Star. Galaxy Star. Yes, yes. All right, uh, yeah, commercials are off. Let's hope one of our players is alive. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what happened to him. Wait a minute, I I'll get somebody to play him. Okay, don't worry. Hang on. <laughs> Everything goes south. Oops. I mean, we had a designated time. So. And we've been talking about all week, so yeah. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm jamming out the music. Ready. Oops. I'm trying to get it as a little quieter. There we go. Oh, there we go. It's just background. Oh. And I also gotta uh, give uh, Matrix some PTSD. Ah! God, what did we do wrong? Papa, <laughs> <laughs> the most terrifying sound. <laughs> I don't know. I'm suffering with PTSD now, Galaxy. <laughs> oh my god! All you just hear is Papa, why? I don't know that I'm doing wrong. <laughs> Why have you forsaken me? Oh. Oh. 
Why have you told God I'm not allowed to have fun? Why? <laughs> How are you doing, Galaxy? <laughs> 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 I'm just losing my mind. It's okay. Didn't have anything to lose, so it's all right. There's nothing there. Don't worry. Just rattled that on my brain. It sounds like one of the dice that just hit the floor. No. Make the pain stop. Wait, wait, wait. Where's Bob? We need him to roll a D100 and double it to 200. Jesus. God damn it. We might as well just roll a D2000. Yeah. If you find something squishy on the floor, just check if my name is on it. <laughs> it's just written on crown property of matrix. <laughs> it doesn't look like it's spelled that way, but it is. <laughs> See, when you take the brain out, you just kind of, you know, I can write. <laughs> Although my handwriting is horrible, so... <laughs> I did. Okay, while we're doing that, I'm doing a box opening. Screw that. No, I'm kidding. Don't you fucking dare. <laughs> I am taking over this part. Don't you fucking dare. Uh, I should show Galaxy Star that one. <laughs> The, uh, the ultimate seeker right here. Just to, uh, we'll call it a seeker. <laughs> I was like, I mean, he's pretty cool looking. I mean, hey. Right, I'll flip to the main screen to see our icons. Yeah. See which one of us is talking and what. <laughs> Oh yeah, so um, what's yeah, been, what's a uh, brain cell? Starburst jelly beans. I've been getting it like sheets in like fucking fourteen ounce bags. Let's see. Yeah. All these things are good. Oh well, yeah, dude, I, I love those Starburst jelly beans. Oops. They're my favorite. The only kind. flavor I never remember Here, uh, making in a Starburst see. is uh, grape. Yep, we we actually had this conversation about that. Yeah, like they've. I do not recall them ever making a grape Starburst, but they make a, the grape yeah. jelly bean. That's the way ceiling. Wrong camera, you stupid me. There you go, Galaxy Star. There you go. Here. What are you doing? Don't, Don't worry, I'm showing her. The, I'm, I'm just doing, doing it through screen. screen. There you go, the, the ultimate seeker. seeker. <laughs> and a 14 tom cat. Save it for your unboxing stream. <laughs> oh, I'm not unboxing him yet. No, but. Yeah, see, see ultimate. I'm just a dumbass. That'd be interesting, Destiny Transformer. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the Destiny <laughs> Transformer? Yeah. The Traveler just turned into a cube. <laughs> no, no, the Traveler's Unicron. Oh my god. <laughs> Unicron. A little small, but yeah, it could work. I mean, he's, he's a, okay, so he's a mini sized Unicron. But, uh, uh, come on, man. Like, we, we all saw him go Death Star mode in that trailer. Yeah, I caught that. I was like, what? <laughs> yeah, I like how people also didn't notice that when the ghost gets cut into tiny pieces, so did the Guardian. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's it, that's Maverick. Uh, well, because the, the focus guns. of the camera is on the ghost, and like you have to look at. Like, I will be opening them. Look at the size. Here. So, yeah, as it you turns see it. Out, I was wrong. Uh, those Guardians are not our Guardian. They are the. Uh, yeah, that's the original D1 team. Guardian. Yeah, no, they're the ones who were in the last city when the Traveler left. They, yeah. We saw them with, like, Zavala and Igora, though. Well, no, they've been around since the D1 trailer. No, I know, but I'm saying we saw them there. Like, yeah. before yep. then, the last time we saw them was there Ooh. in the last city. Mm -hmm. Yep, and now they did. Like the original D1 box art. Like, okay. And they're fucking dead, man. Hey, bro, they died. I think they're upset. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right yeah they're... around ceremoniously, too. They, they just get cut down and just... Get like that. Nah, you're nothing. <coughs> Ow. But yeah. <laughs> I'm just kind of chilling. 
<laughs> well, I, yeah, I'm, I'm just waiting on Matrix. Y'all, y'all set, buddy? You good to go? I'm jamming out. Now we're killing him off. No, uh, Matrix, Sweet. Up, bye. Keep All right. Uh, whenever you guys are ready, I'll kill this music. Yeah, I'm, I'm ready. There we go. Let me kill that and get back to the screen. And it's all yours. Take over. Oh, my DDM. Please don't smite me. Oh, oh, yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> all right. So, welcome back to D and Destiny, the Unsung Heroes. Uh, so, uh, if you are interested in the game, uh, you can check it out at velvetfangames.com slash dndestiny. Go ahead and check them out. The books are free. Go ahead and download them, give it a look, give them some support. Because without them, this game isn't possible. And thank you very much to them. Oh, they have some stuff. Mm -mm, maybe. Yeah, yeah. You can see all the, the downloads right there on the screen there. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, and... They're also working uh, pretty hard on their deck of possibilities uh, project there too. They're this uh, is the one... if you can you can join their Discord. They're talking a lot about it. They're they're putting a lot more uh, time and effort into building this new game that they're creating. So go ahead and check that out. <clears throat> I like the artwork. Yeah, we're not we're not uh, sponsored by them in any way or anything like that we just i just choose to support these guys because i'm using their books and i want to support them any way i can we would like to be sponsored by them please <laughs> dad i would hey, like hey money. hey hey guys hi guys uh, <laughs> <laughs> you, you know i shout you out every uh, episode I'm right not saying, <laughs> I'm, not I'm not saying you got to but <laughs> You can support them well, on Patreon. We, they do have we Patreon. We do support you. And there's <laughs> Learn <laughs> Geo. The <laughs> That's a lot. Something in return. <laughs> they do have a Twitter, Discord, Twitch, YouTube. Contact them if you want. Make it nice. Yeah, yeah. All that's here. Uh, and then if you want to watch any of our past episodes, you can go to this thing. The link is down on the Twitch. And then I'm going to turn it back over to Dave real quick. There you go, Dave. Bye. There, I'm out. Peace. <laughs> All right. So it's been a little while since we've done this. So to kind of give you guys a, a brief recap, uh, you guys uh, did uh, go into the corridors of time and made your way to the edge of time where you um, are going to be encountering God Hand. <clears throat> and as the, the team arrived into the edge of time and they saw what remained of the last city as it was completely demolished and in rubbles. The only thing that they could see was a massive obelisk sitting where the traveler the traveler once sat. And for some of them who may remember, it was the exact same shape and and look as the obelisk that was uncovered to them early on where they all encountered different dark versions of themselves. After arriving in this new area, they encountered the Vex and began a massive battle. After taking down a, a Vex mind and clearing the area of any remnants, they were able to secure the area and have been now making their way to the the foot where the obelisk sits in order to gain access. I want to point out I was stealth that entire combat day. You were, you were. <clears throat> so, from where you guys are at the moment... It's maybe a half a kilometer away from where you, there's an entry point for you guys. And as you're walking along the air, I mean, at this point, you guys, uh, are you going to be walking or are you going to be running? Let's run. Let's get the fuck over there, bro. Okay, because you're, you're spare. The, by, um, 
the terrain is going to be too much for your sparrows because there's mm. just way too much debris all around you. Well, we're just following the harpy or whatever that came and got us. Yep, so it's leading you along just this destroyed path. Like, you can see where there once was a road, but it's it's littered with parts of buildings, boulders, rocks, just all kinds of debris. It's just demolished like my soul. I mean, if you want to look at it that way, I guess. <laughs> Mama, <laughs> but um, <laughs> so as you guys are approaching here, it's rough. It's kind of hard to tell what time of day it is. There's, it's just complete cloud cover. It's gray. It could be either sometime midday or going into mid evening. It's really hard to tell at the moment. There's pretty much no wind. It's just overcast sky. It's looking dreary all around. It's more fucked up in California during a drought. Got it. Uh, mm. California after an earthquake. You mean Turkey after an earthquake? Oh, that's too soon. Ooh, that's too oh, soon. Oh, too soon, too, too soon. soon. <laughs> <laughs> Though I do feel bad for them. But... Yeah. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> Things we get into. So you guys have a little bit of time to talk amongst yourselves while you're making this run. If you guys would like to yeah. converse, this is going to be a good time for you. So hmm. I convinced myself that the ground is made of peanut butter. You can eat the ground? <laughs> <laughs> no, I just scoop it up and throw it at Matrix. Yay! Fun. Oh, this ain't peanut butter. <laughs> peanut butter. <laughs> Disappointment. Next shit. <laughs> I don't know where the Vex could do that. <laughs> so, what's our overall game plan here? Uh, link up with the Vex and then move forward. I guess I'm assaulting that, and I just point toward the uh, tower. And are we going to assume that God Hand will have reinforcements of our selves? a good possibility. Paradox is kind of looking over your shoulder up at the obelisk as you guys are having this conversation. <clears throat> I mean, let's be honest, nothing about this, and I just kind of gestured towards the obelisk, this says we're not going to be getting into a fight. <laughs> I also want to point Imagine out my alternate self of another universe has shitty tapes and decoration. Yeah, standard villain fare, I guess. You became yeah. predictable. How much you want to bet he's going to give us a whole spiel about his ultimate if weapon? If he does, I have a bullet with his name on it. We will see what happens. A bullet for my valentine? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, Elias. Uh. Could I could I do a quick check to see if if we're still able to use our abilities, considering the tablet isn't here and all? Oh, oh sure. So what, I mean, what what are you wanting to check? Like, what do you want to do? Just to, like see if uh like my void abilities are still around me. So like, could I conjure up some void essence? We literally used our abilities last session. Yeah, you session. Really yeah, you, really? you uh. yeah you, you guys no. were were still in in a fight, no, and as far as I know, you definitely used your abilities. Yeah, no, we <laughs> yeah. Used our abilities. Uh, it's it's been a while, so I was like, ah. Eh. Yeah, yeah, no, it, it's fine, it's fine. So how far away are we still right now? We just um. You so said about how you guys are getting fairly close. Uh, is there anything? Visible around, like any thing we might spot as a enemy type thing, opponent. The majority of the horizon line for you is literally just debris, piles of rubble, and the obelisk before you. Okay. You can hear off in the distance the sounds of Vex gunfire, but it's it's pretty far off and behind you. 
you can guess from the sounds of that that they're likely reinforcing the rear, preventing people from coming up behind you. Okay. Let's see. I would like to send up one of my little jo uh, drones. I'm going to send up George. Just kind of send him straight up above us, kind of following along. Probably about, I don't know, what do we say? I could go about 300 feet with him. I believe that was the max we put yeah. for it, yeah. So I'll do just under 300 feet, like maybe 290 or so, so it stays within decent range. And then have it kind of scan around to give us hopefully maybe an eye's view of any motion close by. If there's anything that does approach. All right, so you send up the drone and it starts to ascend. It takes a little bit, um, but you start to get a visual from it, but it, it does appear to be a bit staticky. But you are still able to at least see the, the picture. And as the drone's ascending, you're just looking across a field similar to what you're already seeing. It's it's a lot of piles of debris, and you're seeing Vex fire off in the distance. You're seeing the the lights from their, their laser beams and their... Uh, bolts okay so you're you're seeing the fighting happening off in the distance and there's a lot of it there's a lot of fire off in the distance i just and as uh, you continue... i'm saying do we see jesus flying across the sky on a skateboard no do we see, do we i see want jesus to up? punch you right now <laughs> <laughs> and more uh god jesus skated for our sins <laughs> okay um but if, um yeah is there anything in particular you're trying to find i just want to see if there's anything coming at us or that might be around us that's coming at us can i leave the drone up there just like i said following along but if i lower it down to about 250 feet does that make the signal a little better I mean, you can lower it to 250 if you want to. Yeah, let's lower it to 250, please. And then I'll just have it following along above us. And then just having uh, DB kind of keeping track as well. Mm -hmm. So you lower the, the drone to 250. It's It doesn't really change the view too terribly much for you because there's not really anything that's obscuring its vision. Mm. So Yeah, which is okay. That's good. Yeah, it's it's just a, a field of just busted shit. <laughs> yeah, just, literally. There's, just there's, there's, no, there's no other <laughs> no other way to describe it. Like the city is flattened. Uh, I'll let period. You, it is uh, gone. Uh, when we are a lot closer, I'll have I just inform DB just to recall the drone when we're a lot closer, and then have it put back. Okay. Let's so yeah, it. it's it'll be watching for anything that might be coming in your direction. But Wait. as as you start to approach, uh, the drone does actually see uh, that there are a pair of Vex uh, that are waiting for you. Um, it's about uh, now at this point, maybe 100, 200 meters away from you. you. You're approaching this. And it looks like there's a small circular gate uh, that is behind them, and there's a circular pad underneath it. <clears throat> hmm. And they are standing in wait. Okay. The harpy hmm. is just, like, leading you in, in this direction. It, it's not looking back at you. It's just, just going straight forward. And once it does uh, bring you up to the the platform, it, it does turn around to you <clears throat> and addresses you. <clears throat> Entrance into Obelisk, one way in. Right, so once we go in, there's no getting out through his exit again. It just, it's floating there, and you're seeing its eye just kind of, like, move around and look at all of you. Well, it looks like this is our way in. Do you, is there a way out of 
do they know if I ask them that? Is there a way out? We cannot enter. So you have do not no know of way out. So you have no idea. Okay. So let's hope there is an exit. Either that or we make one. I should be able to do that if anything. I pat you on the shoulder. I I didn't expect nothing less. So as you guys are standing at this uh visor, Paradox has been continuing to stare up at the obelisk. And he he, he turns to you. Do you think this is the same obelisk that we brought into the city you know some time ago good possibility it's vibrating at the same frequency it's it's almost identical even in its shape and it's a very good possibility I don't like this, but we don't really have any we other option. He just nods to you. For better or for worse. Well, if we don't make it out of this, it's been a good run. I am saying and, that to Paradox, by the way. Yeah, yeah. And he, he just... He just he's floating there, kind of, and he just gives you a little nod, and he, he just goes into your pack. <clears throat> So, are you guys ready to go in? Let's do it. Mm. Let's get this done quick and easy. Mm. All right. So I'm gonna step onto the. I'm gonna walk onto the pad. <laughs> Let's do this. All right. So you begin. You all of you step onto the platform, and your vision starts to. It starts to get really bright and brighter who and brought brighter. the flashbang god who fucking jizzed all over the room and turned on a black light sorry <laughs> sorry i had to say that <laughs> to be fair, it's not really a flashbang it's just there's, there is no bang to it it's just come do I have a it's sign? Solar flare. <laughs> I know. Dave <laughs> oh my hell! Stab me right now. <laughs> I'm turning on. I'm like, oh, you didn't. Guys didn't turn on your sunglasses when you came in. <laughs> I'm totally yeah. not palming a blade right now. Woo! <laughs> 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 All right. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> okay. So. <laughs> What's about to happen is going to be a little unique. All of you who experienced your corrupted self when you touched the obelisk are now standing in the same hallway in the vision but you're not standing by your comrades. You are alone, standing in, the, in this hallway. And at the end of the hallway, you see the same figure from your vision, a dark and corrupted version of yourself. I would say I'm the exception, correct? You, what you are seeing is the corrupted version that you became. When you were yeah, under I never the crown's the control, obelisk. you did. No, I never did. I wasn't we there during that. We never touched it. It was just me and um, it was Ash, Uros, oh, yeah. and Reni touched the obelisk. I'm thinking Rosted. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Well, the, you're the exception again? because you did. You were at one point corrupted. So you're yeah. seeing the corrupted version that you became when you wore the crown. Ah. Interesting. Funky. Bug things. 
standing? Like, it is standing I'm... at the foot of a massive stairwell. I would Ooh, like boy. for everyone to roll initiative, but this isn't for combat yet. This yeah. is going to this is going to determine a turn order. Uh, oh shoot! I didn't like get my shoes. It will be a moment. I was tying up my hair. It's initiative oh, no. for the scene because it's going to determine who's going to go first. Uh, oh, that's new. Okay, so when I go to roll, it says public roll or whisper roll. Yep. Yeah, they they put in some new features. Apparently, eight. Uh, initiative. I'm looking in the wrong place. I did all right. I think I did all right. <laughs> that means you're going first against yours. Fuck. <laughs> Wait. Oh, second. They can fucking use the. Uh... Your Actually, no, that's perfect. Character. No, I, I I like it. No, this is perfect. So, Ash. Mm -hmm. Yes. The Dredgen oh. is the one you see at the end of the hallway. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you stole uh, my gun. Fuck, I have one too, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going down right now. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like, you asshole, you stole my gun design. Hey, Kisune, I'll, I'll get to you here just a little bit here, okay? I'm so sorry. So, have you agreed on what day and what time? Now. Right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, We're an, hour, an hour ago. <laughs> no, I know, I know. I, have, I know it's an hour ago. But I'm saying, like, like every week, okay. because I just want to know. <laughs> Well, every week it, it's still it's still Friday, yeah. Like we, it's still Friday. Yeah, it's just okay. because we we missed Friday. We're we're doing it today. So, I wish. I All right. Do that. <laughs> God damn. Otherwise, I would have literally clocked out an hour early from Ooh. work. It's it's okay. <laughs> don't, don't, don't sweat it. <laughs> don't don't sweat it. But uh, yeah, because we're All I right. got something different here for you. So don't worry about it. But anyway, oh, Ash, the exciting <clears> stuff is happening now. Yep. Bad thing to Ash, go you ahead. are standing before the dredgen. Do you walk further into the room? Uh, just a quick question. Is he doing anything, or is he just kind of standing there? He's standing there waiting on you. He's looking right at you. He's standing there. I'm going to go ahead and raise my gun and slowly approach. Raise the door. You're approaching me. Do. Mortal. I can't beat you to death without getting closer. <laughs> All right, so I'll, I'll just kind of move you up here a little bit. So you approach with your cannon up and pointed at him. <clears throat> As he sees you draw your weapon, he snaps his out at you, and he's pointed at you, and you are now in a standoff. Oh, uh, lovely. You wanted to walk my path. Are you really prepared for the horrors that awaits? I wouldn't have done this if I wasn't... I didn't think myself prepared. Certainly I'm doing better than you. Is that what you really think? That you're doing better than me? Yeah. Look around you. The world is coming to an end. Uh, I didn't lose my mind, haven't killed dozens of innocent people. I'm doing all right for myself. You think I've lost my mind, that I'm crazy? Yeah. Yeah, very much no. so. No. I've seen the truth. I've seen the truth of the Traveler, the darkness of the Ahamkara. And there are powers in this world. There are powers in this world that few people can truly fathom. What are we even doing right now? We're just standing here talking. Are you not going to fire your shot? Or are we just going to stand here? Is this how it's going to go? 
Well, if you want to die so quickly, then we can just end the conversation here. And from there, we're going to switch over to Uros. <clears throat> Lovely. Yay! Uros, <laughs> you are seeing... You're seeing the same corrupted version of yourself that you saw in your vision that actually told you about Remy. He's standing there with a hand cannon in hand. He's just holding it. He's not pointing it at you yet. But he's holding it at the ready as he looks at you. So, we meet again? I see you found the gift. Yes. What is it you're meaning to accomplish with all of this? In His light... head is kind of turning a little bit slightly as you're saying this. Why did you do this? Why did you turn to this? He pulls his mask off. And you see <clears throat> your own face, aged and scarred. If you can beat me, I'll tell you everything. And he raises his hand cannon to you. Elias. Mm -hmm. Standing before you is the corrupted version of yourself wearing the crown. His arms are stretched out and he's hovering and you're seeing electric arcs underneath him. Uh, real quick, I need to whisper something to you. Okay. Because this is going to be relevant to the story. Go for it. <clears throat> uh, da, da, da. Pulling up our DM so I can send it over to you. <laughs> Where the hell is your name? There, there it goes. Okay, there you go. Dun, dun, dun. I will tell you he is not with you. Wasn't he in our backpack? He was, but if you were to call for him in the moment right now, he, he will not respond. <clears throat> Okay, then it's a good thing that my helmet has recording software, so I'm actually going to record this entire fight. I just want it in third person. Okay. Because, uh, yeah. And that's going to be a handy little trick for later. <laughs> Surprise tool to help us later. <laughs> yes! Alright. But continue. So yeah, uh, as you you're seeing it, he's he's kind of floating. His arms are, are kind of outstretched a little bit, <clears throat> and it's it's standing there waiting for you. You know, I'm not gonna lie, the crown kind of looks cool. It's interesting seeing it from the outside. Just seeing if he tries to, if he responds. You're just hearing this. It's almost like a growl. It's just. <sighs> and its head is kind of rotating back a little bit. Like. It's. Its mind is being pulled by something and it is being entirely controlled it okay it drops from its float 
and lands on its feet. Arc is beginning to surround his body. Um, how much distance is there between us? Did you walk in further when you addressed no. it? No. So, at the spot you start would be... About 100 feet. 100 feet? Okay. Good, because I never took my sniper rifle out of my hands, and I just dropped down and just fire. All right, so we're going to stop there for you and Theo. By the way, hold on. What level are y'all? Everyone oh, should I'm... be level 10. Okay, yeah. so has everything been upgraded? I I did upgrade your sheet. Okay, I just want to make sure. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure this will be the first time I'm actually seeing my corrupt cell. No, this is the one that you saw when you touched the obelisk. He this didn't is touch it. I didn't touch yes. it. It was he... uh it was Eros, uh Remy and uh, Ash. Ash. Mm, Me, Theo, no, you because oh, I no, I I, no. I have it here that you did touch it because you you had a vision of yourself and it was a juggernaut size. It was double your size. Yeah, we, we remember uh Ash and Eros peer pressured. Theo into touching it. Oh yeah, right. yeah. Touch like he it, he it. he saw a vision. I I have it down here. He did uh, he did see a vision as well. You know, we peer pressured you into, into touching. It. <laughs> yeah, because okay. what you saw was like a busted, broken version of yourself as an EXO, but just like doubled in size, like a Hulk. Because I I know I also got the description from Godhand that mine was, uh. Mad. Well, yeah, like you're you're the epitome of like a machine Hulk. What happens when he gets into the dark inner John? <laughs> and so you're looking down the hall and you're seeing this thing, and it almost looks like a like a giant machine gorilla. He's he's just massively, he's like literally double your size. And he's he's kind of hunched forward a little bit, his arms kind of down, like just going straight down at his sides, and he's looking at you. Oh, is this what befell the champion of the Crucible? <laughs> kind of ironic. Its eyes are cold staring at you, but the vision, like, hit, like the lights, the light in his eyes are, like, blinking. Not, like, blinking, like, in the sense of, like, an eye blink, but, like, blinking is, like, it's kind of, like, flashing, like, your, your power in your system is somehow fluctuating and you're not right. Or Morse code? No. I was gonna say if 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 it was Morse code, I could technically I could technically read that. Damn. No, it's it's inconsistent. Like it's it's a power fluctuation. It's not giving any like Morse code. Is there no way of talking this out, like two gentlemen? I'm I'm hoping for a response of some sort. It kind of looks down at the ground, and then it it raises its fists up and smashes the ground underneath it, <clears throat> and lets out a loud, like gorilla-like roar, and will charge at you. And now we will I'll actually begin combat. Much. I was hoping for too much. So. Now I need to do this.
Yeah, what the fuck? They're all rolling the same initiative. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to complain that they all roll low. Well, I mean, finally someone rolled something different, so I'm, I'm fine with this. <laughs> Just like, there were like the same number for like two of them. Like, what the fuck, you guys? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> and then... So just so everyone's kind of clear, the turn order for this it will be a little confusing because I, I've kind of did this on purpose. But the turn order here is going to be in the same order you started, but the turn order for combat is going to change based on how your opponent rolled. So that's why like, it's going to be a little weird when we get into it, but just kind of follow my lead. So we're starting with Ash. You are starting on your turn order. And you have initiative. What would you like to do? <clears throat> Ash? Sorry. <clears throat> Apologies. I was zoned out. Uh, say again, sorry. Yep, you're first up. Oh, we have to. What is he? Is he? St are we still just in our little standoff? Yep, you're. You're. You got the initiative, so you got first strike. What do you want to do? Uh, I have all my depths of the void charges, right? Yep, you you're fully charged up right now. Um, I need to make sure I remember which grenades, which grenade uh, I want to see situation. Uh, uh, okay. okay, I'm gonna throw a um a scatter grenade at him, and I'm gonna use that one of my depth of the void charge. So that's five times eight. Yes, yeah, so forty damage. Assuming that, assuming he doesn't uh, succeed, it's Let me find the thing real quick. It's a dexterity saving throw. Uh, for the grenade. Okay, he's got pretty good dexterity, but let's see how he rolls. Ah, uh, that's a nineteen. Yeah. Okay, so. I use one of my depths of the void charge, that's 20 really quickly, I need to do one of them in case I don't get Um, I'm also going to take a shot at him with Thorn. Okay, so wait, so did he take the full 40 damage from the grenade, or was that halved because of the dex? Um, hold on, let me make sure I go. Uh, I assume... Oh my god, let me make sure. Yeah, 19 is good. So yeah, he takes uh he takes half damage, so he only takes twenty from that. Okay, twenty for the grenade. Okay. Yeah. And then I'm gonna take a shot at him with Thorn. Alright. <laughs> oh, that's that's damage. You you gotta roll oh, for the attack. Damage. Okay, did the thing. I did the meme. I'm sorry. There 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 you go. Okay. Uh, yeah, that will miss. But, uh, oh. I mean, you still got, got the grenade off, so that's 20 damage, mm -hmm. so that's still, that's still good. Alright. And then that's, that's it, right? Uh, yep, unless you, you have a bonus action you want to use. <clears throat> so where am I in respect to him? I don't remember what I did. Uh, so, this is a question. are these like pillars, or are those just kind of? Yep, those are pillars. All right, and then how far away would that be from me right now? Uh, from your position, about fifteen feet on either side. Uh, 
for void walker level does that is that my actual level or is that some level or is that something else um i think it's referring to your light level because it says because i my blink is is if you're at your nine if you are at nine to void walker level so i'm just wanting to make sure yeah I mean, you would be at a ninth level because you're you're a level 10 so yeah you okay would be. so okay i'm good so um these are actual poems. I'm going to do a. Uh, yeah, I'm going to use a blink to get behind one of these pillars. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so you've got half cover from the pillar in that position. All right, so from that, it's going to be Dredgen's turn. He's going to shot at you. That's definitely missing. Uh, he's going to move into position behind the opposite pillar. And he's going to take another shot. That's a 20 to hit. What would, What's your AC? Uh, 15. And you get, what is it, a plus, what is it, a plus, is it a plus three when you're behind... When you're in half cover, I'm forgetting. Uh, half cover gives you more AC. It's at least a plus two to AC. Yeah. Um, if it's half cover, it's plus two. If it's full cover, it's four. Okay, it's so three. yeah, that that's still gonna hit then. Okay. How much? How much? Uh, let's see. Yeah, I guess he's got Mark of the Devourer too, so this is gonna hurt. Okay. Uh, that's going to be uh, eight darkness damage. Fuck. So is that the actual hit, or is that just the Mark of the Devourer? That's uh, damage. That, uh, that's Mark of the Devourer. I just rolled for that. Because uh, okay. that's that, and then i got to roll the actual weapon damage. Oops. Fucking hell, that's a lot of damage. And that's going to be five kinetic. Okay, so 31. All right, and that's going to be his turn. Uh, so we are moving to Uros. You're yeah. up first. I uh, guess I'm going to whip out uh, Graviton Lance and try and take a shot at him. Or me. So uh, let's see what happens. All right. So, are you staying in the back of the hallway as you do this, or have you moved up at all? Uh, I can, mm, I'm gonna move up a bit. I'll put myself up there so you can see. Okay. And then I can take a shot at him. All right. So take your shots. Yeah. yeah, yeah. There you go. Uh, first is going to miss. Okay. Uh, I'll take another shot then. Hmm? Uh, both of those shots are going to go wide. <clears throat> uh, um, hmm. Wait, I got to I throw my knife. <laughs> Watch it be the one thing it hits. Uh, what's the range on the knife again? Is that, is uh, that 100 feet? No, wait. No, it might not be. Hang on, let me see. Does it show it in here? Is no, it's less getting... than that. No, it's less than that. So never mind. It's up to 60 feet. That's it. So it's not far enough. But never mind. Okay. <clears throat> there really isn't anything else. Okay, but I can yeah, move. so you, you, you got in some... You, you... You shot at him a couple of times, but they, they went wide. Yep. So for oh, his God, turn, uh, and I'm just going to use the same icon just to kind of display this for you, but uh, he's standing here, and he's going to move into the same position. He's going to he's gonna duck behind the pillar, Ooh. and he's going to take some hand cannon shots at you. Of course. Uh, that's a 20 on the first one. Uh -huh. 
for two damage. I didn't do shit. And let's see, the second one is a 16. You still get me. That still hits, okay. Mm -hmm. You good. Two damage again. All right, so he's he's nicking you. He's nicking your shields with these shots. It's, he's he's kind of like he's like side shooting it behind the cover. He's not really aiming it very well. Yell at him. What is this? <laughs> Did I get that lousy as I got older? <laughs> All right, uh, Elias, <laughs> we're up to you, buddy. Um. I will fire my first shot with that sniper rifle. All right. Roll them bones. <laughs> um, would I have advantage laying down? Laying down with this shot, I will say yes, you will have advantage for that. So the first shot will hit. Yep, for the 29 damage. And then... Uh... Roll a strength check for the recoil there. I'm laying down. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. All right, so, yep, do you it's, take a second shot? Yeah, it's just a reload and fire again. Okay. <laughs> that, that, that hits, too. All right, so that's 60, you know, 50, um, 57. Seven, yeah. All right, and just make sure to tick that off your ammo counter. <clears throat> yep, it's somewhere in here. I just gotta find it. Um, but what is he doing immediately by any chance? Like, what's his reaction to those two hits? Um, so upon taking those hits, he's he's been staggered back a little bit. It's it's he's not prone, but you've you've pushed him back a little bit with these shots because. They're anti-tank. They're they're gonna they're fucking him up, but they're not breaking his body. Okay. Um. I can use that chest piece, right? If I wanted to get up super quickly. If there was any charge in it, remember it. I thought we'd got some black <clears throat> matter for it, because that was an entire quest reason why we went to the moon at one point. It was, but then you also got corrupted, and then stuff happened and to no, it. No, this and... was after when we wanted to get fucking um, Ash to test out the gun. Yeah, but this was after that. No, the corrupted was before that. The corrupted reason is the entire reason why I'm out. Right, but the device ended up getting broken. When? This was a while back. Like, I mean, okay, I mean, I'm, I'm just I mean, going I, with it. Yeah, because like I have it written down that it, it did get broken. Like, I was I, never informed of that. I, you maybe want to write the stuff down, dude. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, no, I mean, I was never literally told about that. I mean, you had to have been. But what would you rock with it? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, so uh, yeah, at the moment, yeah, you laid in some pretty good shots. Anyway, you, you got you're doing some serious damage with this fucking thing. I again, I, I somewhat regret giving you this fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, moving on. Uh, this is gonna be Theo's section. Uh, corrupted Theo is the one who goes first. Uh, it's going to charge right at you, and it's going to take a big old swing. It makes the 100, dis uh, 100 distance? It's big. I never moved. Oh. Yep. It's big, and it's fast. <laughs> it it will cover, if you're standing back there, It it's going to cover the distance by using a dash. Because it, it's... it's it has a 50 speed, and it will dash to reach you. It will spend an action to reach you to do it. Yeah, because that was he, he's, he's, he's a raging die. boy. Like, he, he wants to smash you. 
That's what she said. It's gonna swing wide too. These are this is a nine. All, all I have to say is that uh, this is probably gonna be an annoying enemy for me because if he's like me, we we have we probably have we both have an impressive armor class, don't we? Quite possibly. Yeah, so it's it's probably it's gonna be an annoying battle for me. I can tell. So uh, yep, it goes for two swings at you, but you're you're a master of the crucible. You can handle someone throwing punches at you. You see, you just nimbly dodge at these hulking fists. Uh, and that's gonna be its turn. It is now your turn. There is no way I'm using an, this anti tank rifle up close. It's not gonna let you get Dude, distance either. <laughs> He's well, actually, raging, I mean, and he's trying to smash you physically. Like, he's not trying to shoot you with no weapon. He wants to physically put you into the ground. He's not going to let you get distance. I mean, I, I have the strength, so I, I could technically hit fire it. Am I allowed to do that, or you, no? You can hit fire. You are the one person who can because of, you, because of what you are. Okay, then I guess hit fire anti tank rifle. Let's go. Wow, that's just wow. That's, uh, that's a nine. That is not hitting. Yeah, I got a fucking two on that roll. God damn it. Yeah. And then I do have extra attacks, so 15. I'm guessing that's not going to hit. Uh, no, it's definitely not hitting. And because I'm so close, I can't exactly put up a barricade. So, for flavor's sake, you raise the rifle and you're trying to hip fire it, and it moves out of the way, and you plant two rounds into the stairs behind you guys. And being it's an anti tank rifle, these are not small craters you're putting you don't you put into these stairs. These are pretty massive craters that are exploding behind you guys. And that's going to be is, is that it for you or did you have something else? I I physically can't do anything else. He's really close to me. So I I have nothing. All right. <clears throat> uh Ash, we're back to you. Lovely. Um, first things first. Um, yep, that's my grenade. Uh, oh, I just need to reread the. Thing. So, how does the um, the light ability saving throw, uh, work? Just as a question for Mark the Devourer. Uh, let me reread. Because it doesn't say, like, what specifically I'm rolling or what I need to get. Unless I'm just stupid. So light is your your light modifier, and I believe... I, is it constitution? I got I got work. Hang on. <clears throat> Uh, cause yeah, like this is the one piece of equipment that's that's got a complicated feature to it. <laughs> is the light modifier one or two? I mean, no, no it's level? it's your light level. So okay, you'd so have like a, a plus three, and I think oh. it's you, you, I think it's your constitution plus your light level becomes your your light ability saving throw. So that's sixteen. Yeah. So keep that in mind, because I I have to roll that at the end of my turn. Uh, I didn't say it uses up a uh, an action. So uh, I am going to oh, let me just scroll up here. I'm gonna move a little bit more to get in full cover here. So I'm not. Uh. Okay. Yeah. And actually, as I'm reading this, because you did get hit the first time, you you do take 1d8 darkness damage at the start of each of your turns for the next minute. 
So, yep. Uh, so I'll roll that for you real quick. I did this. I was on one. That, that's that's two. Okay. So you, cool. you so take I'm two two darkness. Twenty nine. All right. Uh. Okay. So I move over full cover. Is he still in cover? Or has he moved? Yeah, he's still on cover. You're you're okay. both still on cover at this point. Okay. Um, I'm gonna take a couple more shots at him. I think. Twenty one, and thirteen. All right. Yeah, the first shot will definitely hit. <laughs> and so that's eight. And then he's also going to get darkness damage. So that. Whoop. Oh, that just went flying. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he takes one darkness damage. Fuck. All right, so do I roll? So what do I roll for? Do I just roll constitution saving throw or what? Um. Yeah, roll a con save and then add three to it. Because that's your light level. 22. Okay. Right, so that ends the effect and I become immune. Yep, so yeah, you, yeah, next round you will not have darkness damage. And also he can't afflict it on me anymore, I think. It says immune. Uh, yep, because yep, yeah. you're now immune to the effect for 24 hours. So yeah, yeah you fuck, cannot right. be <laughs> Yep. <laughs> uh, Alright, so that's it then. So I use both my actions. Okay. I moved into full cover, by the way. Okay. Uh, let's see. So he's going to move to the opposite pillar. He's trying to get a better angle on you as he's going to take another shot. That's a five. So that's not, not, that ain't hitting. You dumb bitch. You really shouldn't have said that. Fuck. Because the second shot's a natural 20. Oh my god. Oh. Uh, okay. Do? Um, well, hang on. I'll tell you here in a second. Uh, there we go. That's 13 damage. My god, 16. Okay. Yeah, I mean, he crit, so... <laughs> Fuck. Alright, that's gonna be his turn. Why Eros... are you doing this to me? <laughs> no, we Eros, we're back to you. Alright. I think I would like to move. Kind mm, of get behind cover over here somewhere. But, well, somewhere behind there. Yeah, he, he's in the he's opposite the, pillar from you. Yeah, that's why I remember where he was at. So I'm like up there. So uh, I'm going to try and hit him with Graviton Lance again if I can. And All right. I know he's behind cover, but still. Yep. But please. You got a grenade, too. <clears throat> Shh. I talk about that. Just, just trying to be helpful. I know because I uh, so yeah, thinking, 14's not gonna hit. No, screw this, I'm throwing that in. <laughs> oh yeah. I already had it kind of flied out. I was gonna shoot and then gonna do the grenade anyway, so it was like oh gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> yeah, I was like uh, all right. Uh let's see, so three D six, uh so roll a three D six there for me. Uh, or, oh, no, never mind. It did there. I'm sorry. Did it? Oh, yeah, it did. Never mind. Yeah, it yeah. Did. So, yeah, 10, 10 solar damage. 10. 10. 10. 
And mm. oh, he's got to make a con save too. Okay. Uh, oh, I didn't. Yeah, I only read that one. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, because I'll determine if he takes the full damage. Take it. Take it all. He's not very. He's not very high on con. Nope, he's not passing. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, yep, so he takes the full 10 damage, and he is burning. Burn, baby, burn. Oh, that's... <laughs> uh, is he in range if I try to throw my knife at him? Uh, <laughs> 60 feet. It's 50 right? feet for your knife, right? Uh, 60 maximum. 60? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're... I'm gonna be I'm gonna knife. try and throw my knife at him anyway and see what happens. Let's see All what right. happens. Bonus what? action. Let's see what happens. Uh, yeah. No, no, Off the you, pillar. You stick, you stick the pillar. Oh, that poor pillar. What did I do? I'm sorry. Well, that's all I got. Then. All right, Elias. We're back to you. All right. Um. He still a good bit of ways, right? Uh, yep. Uh, he's about. Let's see, he was about fifty feet from you. Oh, he moved forward fifty feet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, uh, yeah. Yes, I will. And stretch. Mm, I definitely need. Actually, I have throwing knives. I yep. throw knives. Uh, that, Real that misses. I'm gonna use half my movement to get up. Okay. And basically, so catch got... the rifle. Oh, yeah, sorry. Are you moving up or where are you? Cause you I'm got using 15... half my movement to get up. That Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, so you still got 15 feet then. Yeah. Okay. Um, And I'm right here. Where is he in the room? Like, uh, He's going to, yeah, he's he's right in front of you, like right up there. Okay. Um, He's in full reach of Chaos Reach, isn't he? Chaos Reach is 100 feet, isn't it? I'm gonna press it just to test it. Just okay. Because I yeah, I believe it's a hundred feet. Eighty. Eighty feet. Okay. So he um, is within reach. Yep. Yeah, because he's he's fifty feet from you, so he's in range. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna chaos reach. Okay. I'll let you re-roll it because that was 18. just that one. That will hit. <clears throat> and then he's twenty-two arc damage. Okay. Uh, he will have arc resistance, so he that damage is going to be halved because of his resistance. Okay. Um, and so then I'm takes... especially going to take a shot with the Tawalik. Okay. Um, there it is. 16? 16. 16. Let me just double check because I forget. It's... Yes, that will hit. Okay, so and I, and I, it ties. Damage. Yep. Okay. And I'm going to move from there to over here. Okay. Uh, it is now going to be oh, its turn. Uh, actually, oh. one last thing. Uh, where is the button for it? It's the recharge for the super. What is it? A D20? Yep. Five. Okay, so I gotta get fifty or more. Yep. I am done with my turn. All right. So Dark Elias is up, and it's going to return the favor of a Chaos Reach. So let's see how well it, this is gonna roll. Mm -hmm. Does the 16 hit you? Uh, no, it does not. Okay, so you're only going to take half damage. I'm going to roll the actual damage. Uh... Jesus. Uh... There we go.
so that's going to be 10 points of arc damage. All right. Give me one second. You said 10 damage? Yep, 10 damage. Okay. Uh, I will deduct that from my stuff in just a second. Yep. And then... With its second action, it's going to throw out a lightning grenade. And now the question is, is that a dex save for you? Because I believe it is. Uh, help me out here, storm grenade. It's it's AOE. Uh, uh, I'm is gonna three d six or I'm, I'm, yeah, because I'm forgetting what what. Uh, it's thunder it or a lightning grenade. Uh, so I'm gonna press it to start the roll. Uh, it's a fifteen foot cone. Five d eight. Okay. It doesn't show that. No, if you hover uh, over yeah, the damage, yeah. yep, yep. <clears throat> And do I have a roll to see if I have the damage? Uh, yeah. Well, that, that's what I was trying to find was uh, what you need to roll because I think it's a con, or not con, but um, a dex save. If you want me to make a dex roll, I can. Yeah, roll roll a dex save for me. I'm just gonna roll with it because it's 21. taking too long to pull that up the grenade info. Okay. Yep. Uh, so it's going, that damage is going to be halved. All right. And for its movement, um, it's right here. And it's going to move opposite. Getting behind the pillar. Yep. <clears throat> Okay. So it's it's got an angle on you from this position. Actually, it's more like right here from this position, and it's taken cover from you. All right. All right, Theo, we are back to you. Dark yeah. Theo is going to be first in this one. He's swinging his punches. That's a nineteen. That hits. Okay. Okay. Two damage. Woo. And oh, uh, okay. He's not hitting you with that. That's a three. Woo. So he's he's swinging wildly for you. He manages to nick you just a little bit, but you're you're kind of. You're kind of dodging it. Your 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 boxer bobbing and weaving it. This guy ain't nothing. That's his turn. Let the light be with me. I'm gonna do a. Uh, what's it called? I'm doing a heavy framed attack instead of a normal. Okay. That's not gonna hit, and that still uses up my charge. So, yep. wait five, and I'll go. I guess I'll go ahead and do it again. Oh, for the best, twenty-two. That hits, and because it hits, instead of a one d twelve, is three d twelve. Okay, roll that damage. I'm gonna. Roll his DC save here. So on top of the that, let's see. God, he's gonna have some pretty good strength, though, right? Yeah, he hey. does. 30, 30 damage in total. And instead of bludgeoning, that's of solar. So a tie goes to the attacker, right? I think so. I think he would 
Yeah, because um, a tie would succeed yeah. still, right? Yeah. yeah. So okay, yeah, because uh... all right then, yeah. So he's gonna take the full damage of that. Oh, it's not that he. Uh, oh no, he I'm, still I'm takes the damage. It's that if he goes prone or not. Okay. Yep. So tying so... it, he he will get knocked prone. Yeah. Finally, it fucking you, worked. You, you take your your war hammer and you basically uppercut him right in the jaw and knock him backwards. Woo! It finally worked. To me, to me, nonetheless. All right, you got anything else? Uh. Well, I. Uh... Well, considering he's not prone, he doesn't have opportunity attack on me now. So nope. I can actually, I can actually move. Yep. If you if you um, want to move around him, you can. You you have your full movement still. So, ten point thirty would be here. And as bonus action, let me pull up my shit again. I will go ahead and put up barricade. All right, can you point to me on the map where you're putting this up? Uh, let's see. So I was right here. Yep. So, you, you guys are fighting in the hallway here, so. Yeah. So I would, so I'll take it that since I was here, he was more likely here. Yep. So. Yep. I will be putting a barricade, I guess, like on this square here. Okay, so your back's to the wall and right there? <clears throat> Currently, yeah. Okay, gotcha. All right, that's it for you? Uh, yeah, because at, at least it's 15 feet wide, so I don't have to worry about that. And it will be a rally barricade because I need to get shots off badly. Understood. All right, Ash, we are back to you. All right. Um, I was gonna say, all right. So I have my grenade back. Uh, do I do shield charge roll now or do I do it later? Yeah, you, you can do it right now. Okay, what do I roll for that? I can't remember. Uh, it would be your classes thing. So let me quickly check since you're a warlock. You are a void walker, so you your shield is a d6. Okay, so I roll a d6. Lovely. Um, I am going to hold on a second. I'm gonna check something. Okay. Um, I am also going to cast my uh healing rift. So my level is three. So I roll, what is that, 4d8 plus my light ability modifier, or, so roll 4d8, and then my light ability modifier is, what is it? would be 3. Okay, okay, so just 3. So I, uh, hold on a second, I gain uh, 17 shield points for that. Alright. <clears throat> and I'm. Fairly certain, yeah, that is a that is. Oh no, that's and, a bonus action. And bonus. does that go over your maximum shields? Does uh, it give no, you like an overshield? Not. Okay. Um, or it, can it? Uh, I'm not seeing anything that says it can. It doesn't. Okay. Okay, I was just curious if it did. I don't think it can. No. But that's my bonus action. So I still have two actions. Yep. Uh, he is behind this pillar, right? Do I have a decent? Do I have a good? Uh. Do I have, like, um, he's, timeline? I mean, from from this position, you'd be in half cover, but you could go around the pillar and kind of move it towards the center of the room <laughs> and get get a complete shot on him. Uh, if I were to move up to here, like, I'm still kind of behind the pillar, but I'm, I can't really put it there. Because he's right there, right? Yeah. So, like, if, if you want to get, he's like, a, a proper angle on him, like, you would have to move up to, like, say, like, just the, the next square up or even, like, up here. So uh, you can you can get a clean shot on him breaking his cover. Okay, so could I? I'm trying to think here because I want to. Okay, 
I'm gonna come out to get a full to get like a full shot on him. All right. Uh, first things first. I'm going to throw a another scatter grenade. So that's five d eight. I roll twenty five. Assuming he fails the dex uh, saving throw. Oh shit. Okay. Let's see. I would love it if I just killed him right here. Well, he failed that. <clears throat> uh, so twenty that's twenty-five damage? Yes. Okay. And then did you have another attack, or was there was there another? Uh, I still have another attack. Yeah, I can. Do okay. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, he's still up. <clears throat> uh. Well then. Just took a shot. Twenty four. Nat twenty. Natural. Let's fucking 20. go. <laughs> and actually, that reminds me. I need to actually roll his darkness damage because he still has more oh, devour yeah. on him. Yeah. Okay. So. Some ticks of damage there on top of getting critted. <laughs> See, so <laughs> All right, so <clears throat> you break corner <clears throat> and you turn your cannon to him and immediately pop him right in the shoulder. And he's he's looking he's starting to look pretty rough at, in the moment. He's looking he's looking hurt. Alright. Alright, Uros, we are back to you. Uh, Did you do anything? Oh I'm um, oh I'm sorry. No, I'm you sorry. Wanna do no, something? No. I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> We're excited in the battle. Over, right? I'm down, it's, I am yeah. down with having a fair, fair fight against this dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, you are doing the best out of everyone so far. <laughs> what do you mean? Everyone else is currently... Damage-wise. Like, yeah. Everyone else is currently... Like, he, so he's done the most damage. Ass is just he's, he's done 70 yeah. damage so far. The what? only reason I'm struggling is because <laughs> this guy matches my Wait, AC. I'm over 70 damage. What the fuck are you talking about? No, it was halved, remember? Yeah, some of that damage. Some of that in the Tawalak. I have you at 50, not 70. I did 57 the first turn. Oh, I'm sorry. I does the sniper <laughs> shots. That's why I was like, wait, what do you mean? I missed one. Shut up. <laughs> You're. How dare you? I was like, I put two anti-tank rounds into this guy. I I fine. just remembered you missed the one. I'm sorry. <laughs> Anyways, so yes, you are the true point leader in the moment. Thank you. <laughs> pats That's your head. Ass, though. Just pats your head. Eros, <laughs> you're up, buddy. <laughs> okay. He's still burning, so that's a good thing. Uh, yep. Uh, let me actually see. Do I does he take the burning damage on his turn, or is it yeah, on your yeah. turn? Whatever. I'll just roll the damage on his turn. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. <laughs> it's fine. Um, yeah, just go with the flow. Oh crap! I need to recharge shield too. Uh, yep. yep. Roll your your shield recharges. Crap. Yes, please remember to do that because I I remember. No, I I forgot. Because uh, I just remember. Okay. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm just I'm just telling everyone. Just like, please remember, because I I cannot remember okay. that for you. I'm fully charged Ooh, back up. Bro, nice. There bro. we go. It didn't need that much, but okay, sure. Yeah. <laughs> I'll take it. All right. Well, and what else did I do? I did something else. Oh, I know what I did. Damn. I'll fix that too real quick. Uh. Okay. All right. Only halfway there for that one. Okay. All right. Um, he's still behind cover, correct? Oh, yep. And... Yep, because he he's opposite pillar of you right now. Okay, almost. Okay, I can't have use it yet. Um, shoot. Uh, 
I guess I'm just going to try and shoot him again with Graviton Lance. I don't have anything else. Do you want to take your shot from there, or do you want to try and move into position to get a better shot? Hmm, I was thinking that... Um... If I do... Can I move over to this pillar opposite? Whoops, I went too... Oh, the grid holds me there. Never mind. So yeah, I'll, I'll just I'm just gonna move uh, this icon here. So he's he's right yeah. here in the moment. I'm if trying... you move there, you're really not gonna gain any position on him. I'm not liking the spots where it locks me. So I'm like, gosh, stop it. So like, if if you're looking for an angle on him, like you're gonna have to kind of move a little more towards the center, like somewhere like right here, mm, right about I'm here. I'm trying not to lose too much. If he's there, yeah. But I'm just saying, like, if you're, if you're yeah. trying to go for broke, Never mind. if you're trying to get the shot... Oops. Oh, excuse me. If you're trying to get the shot oh. on him, you, you'll want to be a little more in the open. You're exposing yourself, but you're giving yourself a better opportunity. Mm-hmm. I'm going to move here. And... Okay, yeah, you'll from that angle, you will get a clean shot, too. Can I try and hit him with it? Blade Barrage's ass. Yes, you can. You, you have an angle on him. Yeah. You absolutely can. Surprise, so motherfucker. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> oh, wait. Did I even hit him? I just realized. Come on, please. No, well, that... Um, uh, I don't think I do. Not with that, no. No, I didn't think <clears> I would, but it's worth a shot to try. Oh, crap. But I can still... Where'd it go? I'm going to still shoot his ass. <laughs> that hits. Sweet. And I don't have anything okay, so else then. Okay. So for flavor's sake, uh, we're going to make this interesting. You mm -hmm. fired your blade barrage and it went into the pillar. And it pretty much demolishes this pillar. Okay. So I broke things. I, I mean, I'm I'm making this interesting because you didn't actually hit him. We're gonna say your blade barrage did hit the pillar here, and it does destroy the pillar. So next round, he will be exposed. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeehaw. Actually, I I take that back because it's it's gonna be his turn. Yeah, so I was gonna he, say he's broken his cover. But let's see. Now you can't hide. <laughs> yep. I pretty much I don't have anything else, so I'm, I'm done. Yep. I uh, I'm looking to see what he is gonna. He's going to give warm hugs and hot chocolate and cookies. Aww. <laughs> After this, Heroes takes a long vacation and then goes and starts his own baking show. <laughs> baking with a guardian. Okay, so he's going to toss out a lightning grenade at you. Oh, so mean. Uh, let's see, so... I need you to roll a deck save. Oh. Deck save? Alright. Yep. Oh yeah, you're beating it. <laughs> That's a 21. It's gonna be worried. Uh, so you're only going to take... 6 arc damage. Oh, okay. And he's going to roll out from cover, moving into the middle here. And he's going to take a hand cannon shot. Pew, pew. That's a two. God damn it. All right. He just uh, can't so... stand that I am so young and he is both. I'm getting irritated with my dice right now. <laughs> switch the dice, switch the dice. <laughs> Switch up, switch up. I, I, I mean, I, I'm gonna be switching d20s here in a minute. This is getting annoying. <laughs> no, no, stick with it, stick with it, stick with it. 
<laughs> All right. Uh, Elias, we are back to you. Um, I'm going to use my movement to get into half cover. <laughs> okay, so are you taking oh, cover behind sorry. the corner right here? Yeah. Sorry, everyone. Okay. Oh, sorry. Um, yep. No, I was just I was double checking because I, I had a feeling. No, that's what it, was. it was something that happened just now in game. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, where's he at? So he is in the moment right back here, <clears throat> behind this pillar. Okay. Uh, something I also forgot to do is shield recharge. Uh. Yep. Go right ahead. How many is that for me? I think it's it's a either D8? a D6 or a D8. I think I it's a think... D8 for you. Yeah, yeah, it's D8 points. for Warlocks. Uh, All right, so, yep, four points back. Yeah. All right, Um, right, I'm just going to ready my shots using the wall to brace myself, and I guess since he's behind this pillar, uh, I'm just going to put... Uh, wait until he pokes his head out. And then nail him with three consecutive shots, which is actually six. All right, so you're just going to ready your action? Yep. So when he pops out, um, at any point, I fire six shots of Philolock. Okay. Because I have three uh, attacks, and since Talalok is full auto, it counts as two shots per uh, trigger pull. Okay. All right, so that's going to be your turn, and now it's going to be its turn. I'm just checking to see if it has any special movements, which I don't think it does. No, it's just a dash action. Uh, all right. Um, yeah, it's going to try and move out from there and move up kind of in this area, and it's going to be open to your three shots. <clears throat> all right, one second. Uh, and I think after this, you'll have to reload your magazine, because I think you that'll be... No, I haven't emptied this magazine at all. Well, you fired two shots, so if you fire three, isn't that clip? Uh, no, Tlaloc has a magazine of 16. Oh, Tlaloc, I'm sorry, I was thinking of the... I was still thinking of the sniper rifle. No, I'm I sorry. ditched the sniper. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I realize that now, I, but my mind was still thinking you were still holding it. That's fair. Okay. Uh, so yeah, first shot... We'll connect. Second shot. I'm braced, so would that be yeah, an advantage? It, yep, yeah, I was just going to say, for a 16 with advantage, that's still going to hit. So that will hit as well. And then you have one more. One second. Uh, I actually have two more. Oh, because Tala looks... Uh... Yeah, it's full auto. It's six shots total. Yeah. <laughs> that's fucking stupid. <laughs> Alright, there's all your rolls. Alright. All of uh, them literally hit. Uh, so, uh... Yeah. Yeah, they're all gonna hit. Uh, let me, let me do some math here. So, six, eight... 15, 17, 20. So 20 damage. Alright, he's he's looking pretty rough at the moment. His <laughs> armor's his armor's in tatters. It's gonna run down the hall. So what was that? Okay, no, he can still go further. So yeah, he's gonna ex 
He's gonna move in, so you're exposed. One thing I he... also forgot to do is a uh, super recharge, so just a second. Yep, that's fine. I have my super back. It's going to spend its arc charges. It's going to spend six of them to recharge. Let me see. Does it do all of that, or is it just one? I swear if you tell me he's going to do that all to recharge that. his super. And that was an option no. for me the entire time. No, this is this is a different ability. This is this is something that actually comes from the, the bestiary, um, for a risen character. So this isn't like mm. specific to your character. This is actually something from the bestiary. Okay. Yeah, because for I'll, I'll tell you more about this later if you have questions. But yeah. Okay. Uh, so it's going to recharge. It's super. And then it also gains some shield points. So it recharges 11 shield points. It's it's super is recharged for the next round, and that will be actually no, it's got one more action. Hang on. It's just going to go for a weapon attack with a hand cannon. And that's going to miss. That's an eight. Yeah, that definitely misses. Yep. Uh, yeah, because e even with its modifier, that only that would bring it to a 12, so it's still not hidden. <clears throat> yeah. All right. Uh, that is its turn. Uh, th uh, it is now Corrupt Theo's turn. Big ragey boy. Yeah. He's swinging for the fences. See, that is 18. 18 is a mess. Okay. Um, now, Rally Barricade does something happen if an enemy passes through it? I don't believe so. Okay, because, yeah, it's going to charge at you, and it's it's Cause... probably standing pretty much in your barricade at that point. Well, we know in game-wise that it uh, at least does some damage, and it acts almost like it suppresses them. Yeah, yeah, in, in video game it does, but I'm not sure if in the language it's set up that way for the the barricade yeah honestly i i cannot tell because i would actually have to look at that just to make uh, sure i'm hang on I'm, I'm i'm pulling up the card you got here let's see because i only copied what was there for the time yep and that's all that's going to be in the book too because it, it, it does it's not like one-to-one -one what the video game is um so let me yeah yeah, no, uh, I'm not seeing any kind of effect on it. So yeah, like it's just when it walks through the the barricade, you're just you're no longer in cover because he's he's pretty much standing like it's pretty much like standing through your your invisible wall. <laughs> All right, so this first one misses. He's going again. Same roll, so that's not hitting. <clears throat> he's like swinging at you, and you're dodging him, and he's like he's punching the wall, like he like you're. He's swinging wild and heavy, but you you're seeing this come like easily, and you just you're moving out of the way. 
like it's nothing. And that's going to be its turn, and it is now your turn. Well, I guess with you going mad, it makes it a bit easier to dodge. As I'm going to go ahead and go for melee of centigrade, which misses. But since it missed... Actually, I mean... it, like... Mm, yeah, no, it does. Okay. <laughs> I, I was thinking, like, because, like, it's that range, I didn't think it would. But yeah, it does. But because I didn't use the charge, I attempt it again. 25. That hits. Yep, oh, so, yeah, that hits. So 18 damage, and I get an overshield. Yeah. So, uh... All right. Uh, did you have anything else that, like, uh, any recharges you want to do? Uh, I can. I what? I I can do my barricade as well. So I can do my class one, as well as I can do my shield. So shield is fully back. My class, however, I don't think it is. No, it's not. And while I have my overshield, I cannot recharge my melee. So I currently have nothing else. All right, <clears throat> Ash, we are back to you. Let's do this. I um where is he? Where he at? Uh so he is uh right over here. He's right where he was? Okay, cool. Yep. Yeah, no, because we're all in the same area, it gets very, very confusing. Um Yeah. Really quickly. Mm -hmm. It's a D six for my shield charge, right? Yep. D six. Yeah. So, can do that real quick. So I'm gonna put nine. And then another one for my rift, so my rift took three. And then another one for my grenade. Fuck. <laughs> um. Uh. I am going to once again take a couple shots at him. Gonna, there's one. There's two. <laughs> they both hit. <clears throat> Uh, and then I'm going to use my blink to get back into full cover here. So All right. Uh, <laughs> yeah, let me let me actually total up the damage because you and then also the you might uh, it might not even be necessary because <laughs> you're you're getting you're getting close. <laughs> you, you are getting close because he's he's still taking the, the darkness damage on top of that. Yeah, too. he's gonna. He, he so gonna... meanwhile, I'm here back with almost full shield. <laughs> so eighteen twenty six. <laughs> Altogether, he takes thirty four damage between both thorn shots and the darkness damage. Oh, that's amazing. <clears throat> How's he looking? Actually, with that, you have downed him. Yay. You take these couple of shots, and with that natural, with your last shot, the, nat the critical shot, you land the killing blow, sending a thorn shot straight into, right between the eyes, right into his forehead. And the body just falls backwards. And he is no more. I'm gonna run over and steal his gun really quickly just in case he decides to just in case some shit happens. So before you can do that. Yeah, you know. Uh the rest of the, the turns will need to finish. So oh, okay. your your combat is ended. Okay, so I'm just chilling. And, <clears throat> yep, you can you can just kinda chill out now for a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> 
that started really poorly for me, but I turned it around in the end, so I'm happy. Yeah, yeah, no, you turned that around. Uh, Uros, you are now up. Matrix? Are you muted? Yes. Uh, come on, unmute. Thank you. Sorry. You're muted. <laughs> There no, you okay. Sorry, it's I had a little issue. I, well, I saw the blinking on the map. I'm like, is he here talking right now? Aren't you? <laughs> well, it should have unmuted, and it's not responding, so I have to manually do yeah, it. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Yeah, it's good stuff. But no, is he out here somewhere? I can't remember exactly where he was. Yep. So somewhere in there. The, right now, he is a he's exposed, standing right in the middle because he went in and uh, took a shot on you. So yep, he is he's standing Ooh, right in the middle little... of the room. All right. Uh, let me see. Hmm. I guess I'm just going to shoot him. Try to. Oops, wait, wait, it's not there. Okay. That one misses. All right, first one does miss. Yeah, I'll take another shot with it. Yeah, that misses too. Two. And you got your knife back though, don't you? No, I still have to. I have to do another roll, retry. Roll your re You didn't roll your roll your retry. Oh, I didn't re. Oh, yeah. You didn't roll it this round. Uh, yeah. I did it last. That's why I thought you had your melee back. Is no, not. Uh, let's see what happened. Yeah. Okay, it's definitely yeah, back yeah, now. No. So yeah, you. you oh, you and then oh wait a minute, and oh crud! I should have done that. Oh well. I'll take care of that real quick. Okay, that solves that. But I'll throw the knife. There we go. Where'd my knife sheet go? There it is. <sighs> it doesn't hit him. I know it doesn't. Yeah, no, unfortunately oh. not. God, everything's missing. Okay. That's pretty much... Which, I, I, I'm surprised because he doesn't have a, that high of an AC. Hmm. Neither do I. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> like I, I'm feeling I'm feeling a dichotomy here between yeah. Theo and and Eros <laughs> here in, in in their in their combat here. Just thinking in my head, Theo, man, I'm starting to feel your pain right now. I'm starting to feel it. <clears throat> so yeah, I right, so, can't do anything else. I'm done. <laughs> okay, so it is uh, corrupted versions turn. Oh yeah. No, no. Um, oh, I forgot to. I'm gonna do that real quick too. Or I forget. Okay. Oh, cool. Let me right back. There we go. Okay. That was just for something else. No, go on. <laughs> I was like, shoot, forgot that too. He downs me with one shot. It is. It's actually going to run up on you. And it's going to draw a small sword. And it's going to go in for a swing at you. Not nice. That's an 11. No. That is not hidden. So, yeah, no, it... No. it jumps towards you drawing out a blade and takes a swing at you but you nimbly dodge it trilla, trilla, you missed <laughs> and it's gonna go for its second swing that is a 15. that meets all right so that's gonna hit about time let's on to you <laughs> one damage Seriously? I wish I was kidding. Okay. Um. Yeah. Okay. One damage. Just roll a natural one for damage. So fuck my life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. Sure. Weird, but okay. All right. Uh. That's <laughs> gonna be its turn. Elias, we are back to you. All right. Um. He's out in the open, right? Yep. Um, he's, he's basically like right in front of you by 25 feet, but <laughs> about 30 feet, 25, 30 feet. Um, 
I'm gonna pull a Theo. <laughs> oh, no. Uh oh. Uh, because Theo oh, has oh. basically the same sword I do. I have a heavy frame sword, so I'm gonna get right up into his face and oh, no. put his bitch ass down. Also, you gonna use a charge? Um, what charge? He should have arc charges. He's he's a warlock. Yeah. Well, no, like the sword itself has its own separate charges. I never knew. It has it has a a charge of twenty, and to use the heavy frame, it costs five. I never knew that. Oh. I thought it was a sword. No, it it adds Destiny to it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know. I'm just making. It. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm just. Yeah. We're, we're just clowning. My problem. But uh, one second. Yeah. Because that's why uh, when I was rolling my warhammer, uh, it the charge on it was decreasing. Hmm. Because if you miss, it still takes the charge. All right. Uh. Well, I'm still gonna move into him. Where is he standing? Uh, right where the the icon is currently, so right there. Ah, so I'm moving right into his face. Yep. <clears throat> and I guess, I, what is it for a heavy frame? Is it still one d eight? Uh, it would still be the same damage. If it hits, it it's instead of one d eight, it'll be three d eight. All right. But that's it. That's if it succeeds. Nope. Not with that one. <laughs> it's a good which... thing I can swing two more times. Yep, so that's, yep. that's one charge gone. That's a definite fucking hit. Yep, that's... Yep. Critical so... damage is a 19. Nope. Oh, uh, well... Um, you know does what? It have the, does it have what? the jagged? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Then yes, jagged. it would count as crit. Yep. Yep, so uh, that... that We'll say that... I was going to give it to you anyway, just because of, like... Yeah, 19. Not to mention mm -hmm. that you, you still get two additional rolls of uh, D8. Uh, so yeah. So roll two more d8. So that's fifteen damage for the 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 second swing. Yeah, and since I am basically standing over him, I am <laughs> got automatic advantage with Kalala as I'm gonna put two rounds into his forehead, basically, <laughs> since he is not prone. I. I will just go ahead and say this. You can go ahead and execute him however you want to, because he is going to be done when you do this. <laughs> um, I'm just... I'm going to try to keep most of his body intact uh, when I kill him. I'm just putting him out. You're you're just telling me where you're, you're putting in these final shots. <laughs> I... uh, right into his forehead. All right, so you you slash him with the sword. You knock him backwards. You turn. You put your your scout rifle a few feet to his forehead. Well, no, okay. I don't want to put it into his forehead because I want. It, to it's a few crown. feet away. Like I'm saying, like you, like you're you're a few feet away, like pointing it right into his forehead, and you're you're popping these shots like yeah because i you... want to recover that crown because i'm gonna use it as evidence that yeah i was not in my own mind when i killed a certain someone are you fine with shattering or at least not shattering but cracking the faceplate with these shots because you're nailing them right in the head <laughs> um let's just say i'm fucking aiming for the throat to separate his spine what that's Let's just dark, put it like, but okay. <laughs> well, the reason being is that I'm. I don't know. If I, I, I know. I know what you're going will... for. Like, I, I, know I, I know what you're going for, but it's just like, ugh, okay. Like, you could have just put it in his heart, but damn. Nah, fuck that. This guy is fucking undead. If I was still in my own mind, like trapped as an undead, I'd want to be put out as quick as possible. I don't know if he's still alive in there. All right, you pop these two Talalic shots into his neck. And he's he's down and out. And that's going to that's going to end combat for you. I'm just going to go ahead and take his helmet like 
take it off of him. Yeah. So, uh, like I said, with, with everyone else here, like the moment they die, like it's it's we're basically stopping the moment right there. So, like whatever yeah. you want to do, like we'll we'll see what happens afterwards. All right, Theo section. Dark Theo goes first. Yeah. He's doing his thing. Uh, sixteen. Nope. That ain't hitting either. Uh, let me see. Did I give? Because let's see, I gave him something. Odd. Oh, I really didn't. Damn it. That's my bad. Yeah, so uh, he, he's just he's swinging wildly for the fences here, but he's he's not connecting to you. <clears throat> here he is. And that's his turn. Uh, it's up to you now. Uh, Warhammer time. 22. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> yep. He's prone. Um, I'm not doing the uh, the. Uh, oh, you're shot. Not, you're not doing the heavy frame. No, I, I'm I'm not gonna waste too many shots here. I only have oh, okay. two two left. Oh, okay, so, okay, yeah, because I, I just read what it says here. So, so All right, that's yeah, that... twelve damage, yep. and then another attack, nineteen, which would t count as a crit. Yep, and that that's gonna hit anyway. So doubling, so that's twenty six. Six plus the twelve. Wow. Can I bring him down? Please. How do you want to kill him? Uh. Because with the these Warhammer strikes and the fact that you you hit a crit on nineteen. You do just enough damage to me. Well, I crit on I crit on eighteen, which is funny. <laughs> oh well, yeah, but I'm just saying, like the fact that you crit on, on the nineteen, like, and that doubles. Yeah, like. Wait. Or what? Oh, no, I'm. Hang on. Wait, no. I just realized it's not a. That's a it's false a nineteen. Yeah, it's, it's it's a false nineteen. Never mind. It's not a crit. Okay. I I got too excited there. That that's on me. <laughs> That's okay. So, okay, so then in that case, it's almost done. It's on its last legs. Like, he's, he's like, kind of hunched over at this point. The, his frame is badly damaged. But he's still, he's still raging at you. Uros, we are back to you. Yay. Ah, all right. Uh, before I forget to do something again. Hey, okay, almost close. I forgot I used my super and I didn't recharge it the last time. <laughs> like, whoops. No. Uh, can I use my knife? Let's do that now too. Yeah. All right, he's. Still in front of me, so I'm gonna. Yep. yep, he's not moved in the cover. He's still fully exposed. He's showing the whole humidity. Yeah, that's no. No, that that I mean that level oh, hits. Oh, but no. uh, it, he just he has to make a con save to determine if he takes the full. Oh, okay. I never remember yep. how those work. Yep, grenades are AOE. So oh, they're always gonna, they're always gonna hit. It's just gonna be a dependent on if they if they make their con save. Uh, okay. Okay. And he fails. You suck! <laughs> oh wait. <laughs> uh, yeah. That I mean that that's a seven. So he he's failing. Burn, and, baby, and burn. actually, I mean, now that you remind me, uh, he's he's still supposed to take burn damage anyway. 
Bang, booty, boo. So, hey. yeah. uh, Taco Bell tacos. <laughs> uh, this doesn't smell like tacos over here, though. <laughs> So, counting his initial burn damage, your shot, or the, the grenade, excuse me, and then <clears throat> the damage from the grenade. <laughs> so, altogether, that one would be 16. So, 16 damage on that. Oops. <laughs> All right, and you got another attack. Uh, fine. That misses. I hate you. <laughs> Just for the hell of it. That hits. <laughs> <laughs> it's fun when I can recharge okay. things fast. It is, isn't it? <laughs> it's like, oh, wait. Sweet. Does that hurt a little? <laughs> a little there's a sting i got nothing else so. <laughs> all right uh is that everything for you yeah that's all i got that was all okay. my stuff I was done. all right I'm not gonna uh, recharge them again. it's going in <clears throat> for a couple more small sword swings just saying that three times fast. Uh that is a 18. Uh -huh, it will hit me. That hits, so that is... not a heavy as a spy. Yeah. Objection. Uh, four four slashing on the first attack. Oh no, what shall I do? Oh, I forgot to recharge that too, but that's what... you know. <laughs> you guys keep saying shit, and then I roll a natural 20. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Still I'm not doing this on purpose, but I'm <laughs> getting the feeling the karma gods are answering you all right now. <laughs> well, I'm just, you know, taunting him in general. Like, but so. no, like, <laughs> no. This has happened four separate times tonight. Someone has said something, and then I'm, I roll a natural 20 on them. Bring it. I'm not trying. Bring it. <laughs> that is why I am this silent. This is karma, man. I'm telling y'all. Don't that is don't why me. I am silent and I do not poke the bear. Hey, hey, uh, you guys didn't poke the bear in the transformer one. Don't make me bring back the combiner. No, you're, you're not poking the bear. <laughs> you're, you're poking God. <laughs> yeah, poke, poke, stab. <laughs> hey, man, you, 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 you gonna do anything about it? You gonna do anything about it? Natural twenty. I'm just sitting there taunting the character itself. It's like, you suck, dude. <laughs> what did they do? Okay. Get old? Uh, so that's much? eight slashing damage. Oh, on that God. One. Oh, gee. Oh, that hurts so bad. Sorry. <laughs> now I'm taunting. <laughs> See, now I'm not going to feel bad for you. <laughs> When the karma gods answer you, I'm just gonna be like, no, no, he he fucking deserved it. Oh yeah, I did. Um, I know I know. God has answered. Bring it. The will of God is incoming. About time. Oh. Uh, no, I, I think Visor Visor probably knows what I'm talking about when I say that. He's like, bring it. The rule of God is incoming. What's the blast radius on this? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's going to be its turn. We're back to the Hulk. Steal his knives. His little I'm, sword. I'm, 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 I'm going to throw this fucking die away. I swear to God. <laughs> I mean, this, I mean, this particular it... one is pissing me off. <laughs> See, think of it just needs to keep talking shit so you roll good think of it like this he's acting as the character <laughs> yeah he remember is... the first time i met him he did fail a jump to jump through a window mm -hmm. yes. mm -hmm. 
Yeah. Yes, mm. but it's not it's not your roles that's the problem. It's my mm. roles that are the problem because I, he keeps fucking swinging and he keeps fucking missing, and it's like, God damn it, man! I you should be all... better than this. I mean, it's. it's I feel all... bad. I feel bad for Dave because I know his pain. It's rolling. I'm like, oh god. I mean, it also doesn't help that I have a pretty high AC. I know, but he's like on the same level as you, and it's like, why, why can't I not hit you? I mean, he needs a nat. He more or less needs a natural twenty to hit, or have a good modifier. I know. Because he, because he's using his fist, yeah. Yeah. So it's it's not gonna add much of a modifier unless it's a custom thing, which then then. But the thing is, is he hasn't really landed a, a, a solid oh, punch shit. like once. I mean, <laughs> I mean, because if it would at least, he ha he has no brain me. though. That, that's I know. why. I know. I know. Like boy. I, that's that's the one advantage I have. I still have my that, brain intact. Yeah, but that's its turn. It, it's your turn. <laughs> Kill it. It's just your turn. Just it get out. it over with. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Don't tame it, I swear to God. But it's... I want to make it a pet. He, he can be recovered. No, I can just see him being Hulk going, but big monster. <laughs> big monster. <laughs> but big monster. We have to. Oh, I have to take off my glasses. Theo, save him. Bring him back to the light. <laughs> and then everybody dies. Still talk this out. It doesn't have to end like this. You and I both know that. As I guess... Considering it's bludgeoning damage, I can do non-lethal. Yep. So... I, I just want to give a quick response to what you said with that. So as you say this to him, it's looking at you and the feeling you get from it as you're looking at its eyes. You get the sense that it wants you to finish it. A 16 hit. Uh, it does tie, so it will hit. <clears throat> okay, so that's nine damage there. Yep. Twelve won't hit. Nope, twelve does not hit. I can't do anything else besides do my class recharge, which is fully recharged now. Yeah, that's about it. I don't have any bonus action stuff. Okay. Earl, we are back to you. Ooh, me already. Oh, yeah, I guess so, so he's right in front of you, like you guys are okay. face to face in melee range. Okay, okay, okay. okay I gotta do this. Ready? 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 <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind me. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> oh, I'm going to do this one too. Oh, stuff. Okay. I won't worry about that one right now. Uh, um, oh, yeah. I better do this one too. Okay. I won't, need, I won't have that available. So I, I'm going to. <sighs> I'm, I'm going to shoot him again. That hits. Pew, pew. And I'll shoot him again. That one will pew. That will miss. And then I'll throw that at him. That hits. Screw you. Okay. <laughs> you got a knifey? I got a knifey too. <laughs> nice stubby. Stubby, stubby. And that's pretty much it. I don't have anything else. Okay. So I need to write down my shield. That shield's your turn. I do. 
There we go. Okay. Uh, it is going to back up about 20 feet, so move about right here, and it's going to toss out another lightning grenade at you. Light me up. Uh, so I need you to make a uh, con save. Uh, oh, it's right there on the screen that I'm not looking at. Okay, yep, yeah, you will succeed, so you will only take <laughs> five arc damage. Mm. Um. <clears throat> and then with its <laughs> second attack, it's going to fire its hand cannon. That is a 22. That will hit. That absolutely is going to hit. What's the damage? Eight, uh, eight damage. Oh, cool. All right. Alright, and we are back to Theo. <clears throat> Dark Theo is... He's basically out on his last limb. Actually, let me just... Let me do this. It kneels down in front of you and exposes its head. It doesn't say anything, but you you think you understand the gesture. It is now your turn. I'm gonna go ahead and place my hand on on his head. I'll make sure this doesn't happen a second time. And may you rest in peace. As I wish to form the uh, form a grenade in my hand and place it on his head. <clears throat> You place the grenade on to the back of its head. May you rest in peace. Detonate. In the last moment before it detonates, you hear yourself in a very deep and guttural response just say in two words, Thank you. And that is the end of that. Earls, <clears throat> you were the yes, last one. Yes, of course. Uh, hey, Dave, can I cause you some pain real fast? No, go ahead. Can uh, not? Can no, 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 go ahead. Not? I got to do some recharging anyway, so go ahead. Uh... Yeah. Um, check your DMs. Uh-oh. <laughs> the fuck am I looking at? Uh, something that is going to commit you great harm to your soul. That is six pallets of brand new Magic the Gathering cards. Yeah. <laughs> it's the Magic 30th fucking <laughs> Oh, it's oh never mind, never mind. Okay. Um, <laughs> it is the Modern Horizons 2 pack. Yeah. Really? And they are it's a bunch of different ones but that's just one of the boxes he's opened since he works there he's a light all right take things that he finds he has come back and gathered all of it he can sell that for a good amount of money too oh minimally just with a number of cards there that is a minimum of sixty thousand dollars yeah yeah a couple of pallets like that yeah that's five figures a pallet but anyway, Eros. Okay, I already know. Ah, uh, no, I don't have my super yet, so I can't use it. But I have that. Uh, 
Okay. Oh, I got marked down. Uh, God, does it have? I don't know. Does it have? We love Taco oh. Bell. More tacos yeah, in the chat. Taco Bell. No, it does not have high cons. It's going to no. fail. <clears throat> yeah. I remember he doesn't have high con either. All right. Oh, and before I forget, <clears throat> he needs some burn damage. Oh, yes. Please burn him. Don't forget your shield and super recharge. Sorry, I did on uh, while you guys were yeah. chatting. Ain't That's why I said. Geez. Yeah, he did all of it. Yep. Okay. I'm gonna have to recharge grenade on. now, <laughs> again. <laughs> so it's like, eh. but I still have. Yep, you got one more attack, and he's still up. Yeah, that one went wide. Oh my god! What? Okay, fine. Well, I screw <laughs> you. Okay, I'm now I'm done. There you go. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so your corrupted version is looking pretty roughed up at this point. His <laughs> armor is in tatters. He's he's kind of hunched over a little bit. He's struggling to stand. We don't have to do this. He's going to go for another attack. <clears throat> He's going to rush at you again with the small sword. All right. Uh, that is a 21 on the first swing. Okay. Or eight damage. Second one is a 19. Mm hmm. Okay. For six damage. Okay. Hmm. And we're, <clears throat> we're going immediately back to you. Yay. I got to recharge some stuff though, real fast. Yep. Yep. Go ahead. Uh, let's see, that one, okay, that one's good, that one, almost, uh, this one, do this real quick, there we go, and then, uh, yeah. okay, I'll add it to it. Okay, cool. All right. He's looking pretty bad. Okay. Yep. A couple of good shots is probably going to put him down. We can stop now if you want. The only way this ends is one of us dies. But then I can't find out what happened to you. Or us. Then you better be, be the one to succeed. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Um, <laughs> no words said, just light it up. No, 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 he's he's done. He's <laughs> yeah, done with that. Yeah. That's 22 damage that he, he's done. Yeah. <laughs> so, in the moment you toss out Blade Barrage, <clears throat> all the knives dig into his chest, into his arms. He falls down to his knees. <clears throat> oh. hmm. 
and he looks at you as he's burning. I come over and kneel down in front of him. What happened to you? The same thing that happened to everyone. One by one, he took them all. But I made a choice. I chose to betray him. He struggles to stand up and look at you face to face. It wasn't God hand that created the Reaper. I did. Why? The situation was not even. To give you all a chance. So you created this reaper for a reason. I gave my life so that you might have a chance. I hope you can make good on defeating him. And as he says this, his body falls backwards and he explodes into ash. And <clears throat> as this occurs, the light around everyone grows brighter uh, and brighter. That happens, I'm taking his, he uh, his helmet and anything that I can. As so <laughs> you, you, you're reaching for it. You, you, you grab onto it. You come back into the real world. Son of a bitch. All four of you are standing in the exact same hallway that you literally once were in, but the air around you feels clearer, feels more normal than it did just a moment ago. And you guys all see each other again. You're all standing in the same room. And as you guys kind of come to, you hear the footsteps coming up the stairway to your uh, to your right, and you see Singe and Remy running up the stairs, and they look at you, and Remy just looks at you guys. What happened? You guys just up and just disappeared as we entered in, and Singe and I were downstairs, and we had to run up all these stairs, and there was a lot of... She she kind of walks further into the room. Uh, you guys okay? You guys have a weird look on all your faces. I'm still looking down where my older self had fallen. There's nothing there. I know. Just, just it's like I'm looking where he was at one moment. Uh, Remy just kind of turns to Sid and just like, uh, did we miss something? Uh, probably. A lot. You could say that. I don't, I don't know what happened, but, like, something happened? No. 
You don't miss out on anything. Let's just continue. Right. Um, okay. Uh, you guys, um, you remember the obelisk that we all saw before, right? Of course. Well, this is the obelisk. This, it's not a part of the obelisk we saw. It is the obelisk. Hmm. Guys, he put his home right in, under our noses. It was really unexpected. She's kind of looking at the four of you, and she she's noticing something. She's like, none of you seem surprised by that. Did, did you know? Sneaking suspicion. No, we didn't know, per se, but, like, it's not hard to infer based on what we see. Well, um, I guess this is it then, isn't it? And she kind of looks up to the stairway. I guess so. All right. <clears throat> let's so, let's get this over with. So you guys will, all of you as a team will begin to ascend the stairwell. You walk up a, a fairly long flight of stairs. And as you come to the top, you find a massive throne room. Within, <clears throat> it's a it's an open air throne room. There's no ceiling. You're you're walking basically up onto the roof of the obelisk, where this throne sits. And on that throne, sitting. And looking over it, down at you, as you all approach, is God Hand. It's about time. He rises up from the throne. I've been waiting for this moment. The end is before you all. So it won't be our end, they'll be met here. You're on you mean. Really? Correct me in this situation? <laughs> <clears throat> Wait, hold on. Did we catch a nice guy here? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I just spoke. <laughs> um did he ever have a fight? No, he was downstairs. So I'm I'm going to touch on that part in the next episode because I wasn't sure if he was going to be able to get in here, so I plan that we're actually going to go back and see what happened to Remy and Singe before we actually encounter the next, the final fight. So right. we're we're gonna we're gonna show what happened to our other two characters here at the beginning of the next session. Hmm. It was the only way I could make sure I can actually get his story in since I 
since he wasn't here at the moment. <clears throat> I, I wanted to I wanted to keep it in there just to make sure he does get in. So so we're gonna we're gonna it's a bit of a shorter one, obviously, but we're gonna end the session here because in the next one it's gonna be a long, long fight. We're I'm just gonna tell you all that. It's big yeah, evil time, long. guys. <laughs> Whoa. Long yeah. like, uh, big evil time on the next session. <clears throat> So yeah, Singe, I'm sorry I couldn't get to you too much in, in this one, just because I wasn't even sure if you were even gonna make it in. So yeah, I I'm I'm just gonna have you in. Like we're gonna start off with you on the next one. There you go. <sighs> okay, so, so you better be here on time, time, motherfucker. <laughs> on time. <laughs> it's on Friday, right? Friday night. Okay. Okay. Got it. I won't be there. <laughs> I will set up the schedule. I will drag you in here kicking <laughs> and screaming. There is in the Discord, By there is a schedule. <laughs> there is the schedules. I will put the schedules up so that way you guys know when. Oh, by the way, while y'all were doing this, I was just looking at what do you call it? Finishing up playing The Legend of Zelda. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, the, the, these guys are over here playing War Thunder and whatever else they're playing while, while was... in game, so I'm not surprised. I was cleaning. <laughs> I just have an idle game going. I don't know what you're talking about. Really big chilling right now. I am being chilling, <laughs> watching <laughs> Chinese propaganda. Oh my god. Twitch, give me money because I'm watching Chinese propaganda. <laughs> oh, your parents are Asian. Uh, oh my god. No. <laughs> what is happening? Yeah, I. I it's Asian man. I, I don't know. Emotional no, damage. I was waiting for it. Emotional we become racist, we show you a good time. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, we're going to end this, uh, yeah, you know. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> 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 you need me, I'll edit it. Wait, this stream is so long. Wait, I can fix this really quick. There we go. Now they can't hear me, I can't hear them, and nobody else can hear them. <laughs> except for you can hear me. <laughs> I just mute everything. <laughs> Yes, stream is still ready for the moment. Uh, okay, you guys got anything to plug? Uh, don't add or subtract to the population over the w next two weeks, please. Two years. Make it two years, please. Uh, Tuesday, I am going to stream some of the new Destiny expansion because I have the day off. And if I can Ooh. get Destiny to work on OBS for me because it does not want to work for me most of the time um is it just a black screen yeah uh you got to put it in ex uh windowed full screen i yeah. do that and it still doesn't work uh, uh, or rather I, i'll take it back it works 50 percent of the time yeah like you got to put it in windowed full screen and there's uh, a certain way to capture yeah it but... yeah OBS. and and the thing is like i have it set up but when i turn obs off and turn it back on it doesn't want to work like yeah, they're it's, talking it's, technical. It's a really, it's a really stupid problem. Uh, yeah, Galaxy Star, my <laughs> link should be down in the. It's in the uh, Twitch chat, uh, the Twitch a chat channel or channel. You'll see the link for uh, Space Ghost Abe, and you just click on it. It should take you to his channel. Let me know if it's having a problem because before, yeah, even for like my YouTube in our Discord too, so yeah. you'll get the the pop up alerts uh, when I do start streaming. So. Yeah, uh, it shows up in their to, streams. To see it when I go live, just like uh, just like we do with this one. You, you'll yeah. see all of our streams if we ever do that. So yeah, and we'll, then we'll somebody we'll somebody else has a channel. I keep calling yeah. user redacted all the time now, just because it's fun to say. But it, he goes by Frosted he's, Merc on those ones. And what were those yeah, platforms? He, he's, he's he's gearing up to start his own stream. Yeah, and yeah. In two weeks' time, I'll be streaming my own campaign. Yeah. Which yeah. you make your character. <laughs> and we, what, uh, we've already we've already talked about it. Like I, we just need to get the numbers on the sheet. Yeah, well, we we have work out the numbers. Uh, uh, what uh, what's your thing that you go under Twitch again? Is it, it's Frosted Merc, right? All one Frosted word. Frosted Merc. Yep, all one word. And uh, I will put his capital, link. Capital. Oh, sorry. Go on. Go put on. it in. Uh, put it in the Twitch uh, chat so Galaxy yep. Star can can see your link. 
Yeah, you yeah. can drop. You should be able to drop it in there. Yeah. If it won't allow you, I'll put it in there. Wait, I need to first. I need to actually figure out how to do it because my first time I'm actually trying to fucking do uh, this. Uh, you just uh, put it to right. your your Twitch channel. I right will also there. add it to the. Uh... Yeah. There. Uh, that works. Uh. What? You put three asterisks in the chat. Yeah. Oh, it might. For some reason, it might be. Well, well, I'm a there mod. You go. I thought. I... Okay, yeah. Like, there you I'm go. Mod, I, I don't I'd be able to like. Yeah, you should do something be. about that. It, Even I, I can't do. That's, it. Why I, that's why I was confused. I'm like, wait, why can't I do anything about that? <laughs> yeah, even I can't do anything about it. Okay, that's weird. Um. Hmm. Roster Merc might become a uh, thing. I need to, there we go. Now he's got 18 followers. Let's do it there. Let's go. <laughs> so Let's I'll make sure. Sh Shit, that's doing numbers. Yeah. Dude, you're doing numbers. So I will have his link in the Twitch, but also I will try to put it in the uh, Discord yeah, thing. So, um, so that way it will pop up and notify you when he starts doing his thing as well. And yeah, we'll. I, I, I do need to get consent. From the players that if it's fine first which at least yeah. most of them seem to chill with them and i'll add it to the schedule in here so I mean, you know people can see. you don't even need, need to ask me. <laughs> yeah it's just, it's just one more person that i need to ask yeah, yeah. that's our i mean yeah we'll get i'll get it more set up so this way it directs some to you as well so that way people can go over and see you and bug you and harass you harass him a lot okay just okay, give I'm him a drop out call y'all have a good one and that, have a good man. take it easy so, Oh no, go away. She's trying to okay, okay. Say, go away. Cool. No. I went to harass him. No, you can harass him later. <laughs> Sorry, hey, Mercer. We're wrapping up, so you gotta go, you gotta go. No, but you guys go ahead and then I'm sorry, I'm switching screens. There we go. Oh, and I gotta switch back I'll to the you screen. All. <laughs> all right, see you. Get you. Yeah, have a good one, man. Yeah, next Friday we're we'll be doing this. Yeah. We're not gonna do a week off because we don't have a Transformers campaign to worry about at the moment, yeah. so we're 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 going in. We're gonna yeah. finish this up. Uh, yeah, we can use that next week, depending on how long the combat goes. Because it's like I said, we're facing the big evil here. This is not gonna be a short fight. So yeah, um, yeah, and I'll have a schedule set up. So yeah. I will try and get all that wrapped up so you guys know when and where. Again. Yeah, Kitsune, has, uh, you have your own channel, too. I don't know what it's called. Don't care. There we go. <laughs> man. You're just going to do this, man. Dirty like that. Yeah, yeah. Damn. Yeah. As just... everyone else shamelessly plugs, I don't get anything. I'm just... Come on. If you got something to plug, plug it. I don't mind. Yeah, go put, for put it. Your, put your link in the chat. Let, let, let the people it... know. I don't, I don't know, know where what... you at. Yeah, I don't know why. Yeah, I, got, I got nothing. I got nothing. <laughs> No, yeah, he lies. There's stuff there. We just can't. We can't. We can't t put it up there. It's just not. No, mm, uh, no. But no. Yeah. Anyway, if you want to catch past episodes and relive it up it's to this on moment, YouTube's. on the YouTube, look for the playlists, and they will be there. You'll see Destiny, Dungeons of Destiny, Unsung Heroes. You'll see the Transformer one as well. You'll see my other content I do on the side just for the heck of it. I will be doing a box opening here very soon because uh, I got a lot to open. Um, I've got a lot of deals. So, and then check out Velvet Fang for the Destiny content for making your own campaign. They also have their own Patreon, so you can throw some money at them. They got the desk, desk, deck of possibilities also, and they also have their own thing. You can join their Discord. They do actually do have a lot going on in there. Yeah, they have seminars in there too. If you have questions about, you know, doing a campaign, creating monsters, uh, creating missions, like they have, they have little symposiums and discussions where they just talk it out and give you ideas. So if if it's yeah. interesting to you, join their Discord. Yeah, and, Twitter, you know, go Discord, check them out. Twitch, YouTube. They're, they're, they're it's a very active group, and there's a lot of discussion in there. So feel free yeah. to, to check them out. And then, uh, yep, yeah, we're on roll 20. Yes, 
sponsor us. How's that? <laughs> so big, please. No. Uh, but no. Yeah, all the information's out there on out there under the Twitch. But as soon as you go to the YouTube, there's more links there. I'm gonna be adding a lot more stuff link wise, so that way you can all find others quickly and hopefully a little faster if you need to. Uh, like Frosted Mercs, you can go get him and check him out when he starts to. You got Dave who's streaming stuff, which I'm gonna try and watch, but I'll probably be at work with you doing it. So. Which will be hard. I mean, I'm gonna, I'll probably start like in the afternoon just because I work. Oh, the that's before. right. So I probably won't even start until. Oh, so then I get actually get to see something. Well, and, and and here's the other thing: is Destiny is notorious for day one expansion issues, so I'm somewhat oh. expecting it to start a little late. But who knows? Maybe they 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 nail it this time, and there's not you know like a queue of like tens of thousands of people waiting to get into the game like i've had to do oh, in the past <laughs> yeah so that's, that, that's why i'm like i i'm expecting it to start late because of it but i i mean whenever i can get in and start playing it i'm gonna start streaming it yeah uh, i'll try and help you out yeah. with the obs issue too so that way yeah if, if if i i guess i'm gonna try and test it uh monday night get everything set up and hopefully get it working and then pray and cross my fingers that when I close the program and reopen it, it's going to fucking work. <laughs> yeah, that's the because fun part. I, I hmm. don't get, like, why... Because everything is set and it should just work because no settings change. But somehow, uh, whenever there's an update or something happens, mm -hmm. I have to start the whole goddamn thing over. Yeah, a lot of times I had to literally either it's delete the, the one thing... To... Put it back on up. OBS. Like I can get everything else to work on OBS mm -hmm. like that. It's no problem. But Destiny gives me the most problems. Yep. Like when I'm trying to stream it, and I yeah. don't understand it. It can be a pain, especially with Destiny. And there's a few games I have that actually I have to run it full screen for that reason. So yeah, same issue. It becomes a pain in the butt, especially when they update anything to do with graphics. Suddenly everything gets messed up there. So. Yeah. So, but yeah, I'll, I'll be I'll do my best to get a stream for Tuesday with the the new expansion. Yep. We'll go check out Nia Muna together. Woo! And you'll see, like I said, uh, Galaxy Star. You'll find Discord will ping you uh, through that under the streams, and it'll tell you. I'll get Frosted Mercs put in there too, so that way it shows up. Now that I have his channel. Yeah. <laughs> so. Uh, I will get that done as well and put more information down below so you can find it. But with all that, you guys want to say night, bye, morning, evening, whatever, wherever you're at. I don't know what time you're we'll see you next week. Done. Get some sleep. <laughs> Let the calming hold guide your heart. Okay, I, I, I'm done. I can't top that. Mine's just have a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're at in the world. Just be safe out there. Have a good, have a good you know, time. good day, good time. Whatever. Bye.